I just need one and a half minutes to tell you why linking the ideas in your documentation is going to really help your business. The number one thing that keeps me busy working with documentation from practitioners in the field is taking the ideas and the information that they already have in their notes and linking it together. As a practitioner, you're seeing what the problem is and linking it together in your mind with the functional need and the solution. However, it doesn't always come out on paper. It is our job as the prosthetist to write this up in terms that anyone can understand. And that's the hard part. It takes looking at your notes in a new way, but maybe even having fresh eyes look at the note. Someone here at Code, one of your front office people, to see can they answer the question, why does this person need a new socket? Why does this person need a new foot? What is the functional need? Can they find it in the note? And if they have to hunt it down, if it's not really obvious and put together in one clear, concise spot, then it's not good enough. In the plan, you want to bring it home into one set of facts, all the information brought down into one little paragraph. A paragraph like this one. Mrs. Smith states that she has pain and feels unsteady in her prosthesis. The current socket can't be adjusted to remedy these problems because the physiological change in Mrs. Smith's residual limb is too great. Right there, I've taken the first issue, the problem, and put it into that sentence. It may be stated somewhere else in the note, but I'm stating it again. A new socket will need to be created to accommodate the physiological change. Again, I'm just pointing out that you want to use the word physiological change because that's what the computers want to see. That's what's in the LCD. A new prosthetic socket will improve her endurance and balance, thus addressing her functional needs. It links everything that you've already discussed in detail in the rest of your note and puts it into one concise little sentence or paragraph. Do you have ideas for one of our videos? Then please email us at code at spsco.com. That's C-O-D-E at spsco.com. Thanks.